Mark Weymouth on Saturday. What's your thoughts ahead of the game? Thoughts always, always similar, Henry, as you well know. Um, games come thick and fast in a three game in a three game week. Um, Weymouth, we've obviously watched back their last few games. Um, we've got, got some very good threats. I know some of their players well. And um, again, it's going to be a, a really, really tough game. Obviously, you mentioned the three-game week there. How do you reflect on the week's performances so far? Um, yeah, there's been plenty of positives. Um, I think certainly out of possession, we've been strong. And we're looking to refine and, and improve all the time. So, um, look, we've got some areas to work on, but we've also got some, some areas to keep um, keep keep making our, our strength as well. So, um, look, we're, we're learning all the time. And we learnt a lot on Tuesday and we probably got caught a little bit in our out of possession mindset for too long in the game. But being in the lead, sometimes that dictates that. So, yeah, like I said, we're always looking for, for areas to improve. The boys have worked ever so hard. They continue to work hard. Like I said, I feel that we're getting fitter and stronger and then we'll know how good this week's been after Saturday. How important has, has that fitness been in terms of, you know, the three game week, like you mentioned, how important is that in terms of getting the results you're after? Yeah, it's, it's vital. Said so this, this league's really, really tough, really demanding, physically and mentally. So um, look, I, f- I feel that we're we're standing up uh, physically to that. Um, but like I said, the, the proof will always be in, in Saturday. Of course, a bit of transfer news during the week. Obviously, Mo Betham has gone to Mason on loan. No doubt that's for fitness reasons or just getting back up to speed. Yeah, Mo's uh, you know been out injured for a while. Like I said earlier on in the week, he's um, he was had an injury in pre-season before we were here. Uh, and probably didn't quite get up to speed when we first come in and unfortunately got injured. So we're trying to kickstart him for the season. He's worked hard behind the scenes and he's put himself in a good position now where I feel that um, you know we can go and get more minutes at the moment uh, and get himself up to speed and, and hopefully come back knocking on our door. And of course, with that, that leaves an opening for you know other players to step up and potentially you know look to forward the forward the line. Yeah, look, we're always looking to improve and um, you know sometimes... Mo's gone out for his own personal reasons to get back fitter and stronger, ready for us. But like I said, that might might be an opening for us, for someone else. But I said, we're only, this group's worked really hard and they've got a good, strong mentality. We've got a good togetherness about us. So when we look, you know, you've got to be a special type of player to, to come in and improve us now. And we've got to look for that right character. And injury wise, what's the latest on players that are returning? Uh, well, look, we've Kevin Locko's back out on the grass again. So um, look, he's been out for some time and, his, his return to play isn't going to be as, as, as quick and as easy as, as the others for the, the nature of his injury and how long he's been out. But it's, it's great to see see him um, out on the on the grass or the Astro, so to speak. So um, we're hoping he's not too far away from joining back into training, which will be great. And, and the other ones coming back continue to build their minutes and hopefully getting stronger and fitter as it goes on. We had a couple come off on uh, in midweek. We've had a late check on them. Um, so to see whether they can be involved tomorrow or not. Of course, we play the second of your old team, second of two of your old teams in terms of Weymouth. What's your thoughts on their performances and how they've been doing? I think the last performances have been very strong. They've got a really good balance about them. Um, you know, they've, they've got some very good players. Um, so, look, it's going to be a really, really tough game. Um, people obviously say I've played two of my, my ex teams. That hasn't even come into my mind at all. I'm just fully focused on. On, on what we do, um, we always show respect to the opposition in how we prepare. Um, so that, that's definitely the case this week. Of course, a, a managerial change quite recent for them, so they'll be looking to continue their good form like they did against Bournemouth Wood. Yeah, definitely. Look, great point for them. Like not many teams go to Bournemouth Wood and get something. So, and I know they pushed Dagenham all the way as well. Another great team in this league. So, look, they're certainly um, being probably energised um, by a new manager coming in, and we've got to be ready for that. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.